Tron is such a beloved franchise, and the expectation is you better get the light cycles right, you better get the light disc right, you know. So that's one area that we've really spent a long time in development on. This ain't your daddy's Tron. You see what the video game world looked like in the original Tron to where this new current one. We've come so far. The old Tron looks strangely innocent now, and we were so state-of-the-art at the time. We work with computers all the time, and just the idea that there's a fantasy universe and you know, things that we hold in our pockets, it's pretty enticing. They were just starting to explore the emergence of technology and whether or not it would take over their lives. Now, we can safely say it has taken over our lives. It's exciting to be a part of that movement, to know that we are making something that will take people to another place, blow their minds, and will make them consider technology and its role in our lives. You can clearly see the inspiration that the new movie and our game has going back to the original. I think a lot of our challenge is not losing that heart and soul, right? A lot of people on this team, including myself, that have very fond memories of Tron and have put a lot of passion, a lot of effort into actually making the game. And I think that will come across when people pick up the game and go, wow, you know, these people actually really did care about what they were doing.